It's leg two of Quick Targa West, and the teams of Cruz have found their way out to 2J, a small historic town in the Avon Valley. I'm standing in front of Connor's Mill, which was built by convicts back in 1870, so a real amount of history involved in this town. It even has its own Coca-Cola museum and cafe down the main street. But our job's to go through to the service park and catch up with some of the leaders and see how their morning's gone. Jim, uh, looking way too relaxed uh, to be in the lead of a tarmac rally. Well, we've got nothing to do on the car, so we're just sort of sitting around waiting for our time to come up. <laughs> Surely Barry can make a cup of tea or something for you. Well, you brought me a bottle of water, so that's uh, most one thing. <laughs> How are you finding the stages this morning? No, good. Yeah, all, all good. Yeah, no, no, no. You've got a handy lead, but are you obviously just monitoring your times or are you just uh, setting so your own pace? I haven't seen any other times all day today, so I don't okay. know. I, I, I think we might be increasing it slightly. I don't know. Um, but we only know that because the guy in front of us seems to be rolling into the time check when we're coming through, so we, we think we're, we're, we're making a bit of time. Good stuff, going well. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Jamie, very quickly, how's your morning been so far, mate? Oh, very, very good, very safe, and um, yeah, a few of the, few of the are some more experienced guys are caught up, but we're okay with that. We're just going to run our own race and um, keep it safe. Yeah, so you're okay with that. Like you said, you've got to know what your balance is like, and you're obviously pleased with the pace you are holding. Yeah, no, we, we had a look at the results last night. We've been punching above our weight for a couple of days, and we knew it all coming. You're doing very well, mate. Hang in there. Yep, thank you. Ben Searcy and James Marquette uh, into second. How good is that? You're on fire this morning. Yeah, yeah. We tried to pull a bit of time back on Lister and uh, hopefully we'll see if we can get a bit more time back on Jimmy too. Yeah, you took a little bit of time out of him and he's not too far away. I'm sure he's sort of playing his cards right. What are you putting down to today? Is this where your pacing experience and rally experience overall comes into play, do you think, on these sorts of roads? Yeah, I think the, the first time through the stages is where the notes are really important. So I, I reckon that we can make up time on the first passes of each of the stages and then they'll probably catch up a bit more on the next ones. Going well, mate. I'm an Evo hunter. That's exactly what I love to do. Um, and I think about a couple seconds here and there, so I'm looking a little bit. I uh, love these long open stages. They're, the GDR just loves them, so eating them up.